Taking the company public last fall, um, it was an incredible milestone. I think you know, to found this company, starting this company at a point where um, it was always hard for us to raise money, where we were shipping fixes out of our office for many years. It was a dream that someday we would have a business that would be of the scale of a billion dollars and a dream that we'd be able to take the, the company to a place where we'd, we'd be able to have public shareholders. It was also, I think, really rewarding to get to be um, part of, I think, what, a, what was a significant milestone for women. And it was something that maybe earlier in my career I was more resistant to, and I wanted to be known as being a successful CEO and not being a successful female CEO. But um, the, the reality is I think there aren't enough role models out there and there aren't enough examples um, of people to be able to look to as, um, as you know, younger entrepreneurs and, um, and young people are deciding what future is right for them. And so I really came to embrace the idea of really being able to represent a milestone um, not just for me and not just for Stitch Fix but for women and it's really meant a lot to me to be able to hear so much positive feedback I think from the um, from the entrepreneur community and from the broader community and um, and so it was a it was a really important moment for for myself but also my family for the company and I think um, for the broader ecosystem. The advice that I would have for somebody who is um, just starting as an entrepreneur, frankly, in, in any role, um, is really to be shameless and curious. I think I, the idea of being a lifelong learner is something that I, can benefit you your whole life. And um, one of the things early in Stitch Fix that I would do is I would create a list of just like amazing people, just people that I wanted to meet, people that I could learn from. And I was just on a journey of learning and trying to find the people that are going to help me to um, understand my business better, help me to hire the right people. And that journey of learning led me to hiring great people, led me to adding people to my board, to recruiting people I never dreamed I'd be able to recruit. And I think all of that really comes from being able to be curious about everything and also just being shameless and pe pinging people on LinkedIn and asking people for intros. And the worst that somebody's going to say is no. And, um, and so I think that shameless curiosity is something that, um, that I think can benefit everybody.